Is remaining independent at home important to you? My choice in home and senior care can make that possible. We give you the assurance that you or your loved one is being cared for in the comfort of their own home by a certified caregiver. We offer flexible services that are customized to your needs. Call us today for your free, no obligation, in-home assessment. Be sure to ask about VA benefits. My choice in home and senior care. We specialize in you. And Julie Zimmer is here today with My Choice in Home Care. Nice to see you. Good to see you. How are you? Very good. You know, we just uh, showed your spot there and your list of all the different services that uh, you offer. And um, tell me a little bit about, uh, we're going we're gonna to get into our, your respite service and a few other services, your shared service. But in general, tell us about uh, what you offer in uh, your home care Ours is a little different than a lot of home cares because we offer a little wider range of different types of services. So we can give just a plain caregiver that can go in just to fix a meal and help them shower and things like that. But we also have RNs and LVNs for private duty nursing for those more difficult types of patients that have catheters and Ebola okay. tubes and things like that. So we can actually go in the home when they need an RN or an LVN. We actually have live-ins that are RNs and LVNs for that critical time also. For example, if they've come home from the hospital and they're trying to transition from the hospital to a skilled nursing facility back home and get used to their home environment, regain their independence, or maybe they're not going to regain independence and they need more specific type of care that's more medical-based care, we also have RNs and LVNs as well as general caregivers that can go in and, and live with them or just go on an hourly basis. So we have a two-hour minimum all the way to 24-7 care. Okay, very good. You know, another thing I saw on that list that was going by there is transportation. So uh, you will go in if, if somebody just needs a transportation to their doctor or something like that, you can fis facilitate that? Correct. We have a lot of even facilities that we do transportation. We'll follow the patient to their doctor's office, take all the notes, report back to their children or to uh, another doctor if they need it or to the, the skilled nursing facility exactly what took place during that visit with their physician. Mm -hmm. Or we can just transport them. A lot of people want to go see their sister and they haven't seen them for a while and they might live in San Diego and so they need a ride from Orange County to San Diego, they don't drive anymore. So we'll drive them down so they can still stay connected with their oh, okay. family members as well. All right, very good. So you, you'll go uh, that far down. Oh yeah, we drive so, everywhere. Yeah. We, we go everywhere. We even have a certain caregivers that will fly with the patient. Wow. So they'll get on the airplane, flying back to New York, make sure that they are delivered to their family safely, and then turn around and fly back. Wow. So we've done a lot of that too. We'll, we'll transport them wherever they need to go. Wow, very good. Tell me a little bit about um, respite care and uh, how it can help people out. Respite care is very necessary. I know when I was taking care of my father for mm -hmm. 39 years being a paraplegic, uh, my mom and all of us would need a break once in a while. And what we do is we bring a caregiver into the home for however much they need. Some people need total supervision and 24-7 for that respite care. Some people only need to be checked on two or three times a day for a couple hours at a time. But the idea is when you need to go away and go on vacation, but you still need care for mom and dad or your spouse, we come in and we will make sure that they're being cared for so that you can relax and get the respite that you need and go on your vacation. How would somebody set this up? Because it sounds like it's more on a temporary basis. Correct. It's temporary. It's for however long you would be out of town. Mm -hmm. So all they do is call us. We come in. We do an assessment, get a list of the needs of the patient, get their likes and dislikes for foods, get their regular routine when their medications need to be taken, what medications need to be taken, if they have any doctor's visits while you're gone that we need to make sure they attend and take the notes and make sure everybody understands there's a change in medication maybe or everything's fine and they're doing great. We'll make sure that we keep all those notes so when you get home you know exactly what took place during your stay away from your loved one. All right, and would you also do anything that's needed um, in the household that would normally be done during that week, whether it's uh, doing laundry or maybe they have a pet that needs looking after? Absolutely, we take care of all that. So we do anything and everything so they can still remain independent at home. It'll be like you never left. So we do all the laundry, we'll sterilize kitchens, bathrooms, fix all the meals. We'll take little Roxy out on a walk if you need it, or feed the cats and clean up after them too. So we do anything that needs to be done in the household. We'll call it the personal attendant. And a personal attendant basically does whatever you need to have done so you can remain independent at home. 
All right. That's not, you don't do uh, kids, because sometimes my wife and I could use a respite from our seven-year-old. Well, year -old. actually, we have a few of those cases. <laughs> we'll but, call you uh, up and say, hey, can you come by this afternoon? We need a little break. Um, what, uh, you know, you're, you're talking about all the different things that you do here, from the transportation to the respite care. Is this what differentiates you from your, the other uh, home care companies? I think what really sets us apart is the fact that I was a physician for 27 years and I've retired from that and I run this company now. Mm -hmm. And I can go into a home and I can assess the situation and really take a look at their overall condition and their overall health and also assist them in saying, hey, you know, your ankles are a little swollen was the last time you went to the doctor. Make sure they're on the right medications, make sure that their general health is good. I can also assist them to make sure that if they have congestive heart failure, for example, they understand what a two milligram sodium diet is and how to take care of that. So my caregivers are all taught, what is a two milligram sodium diet? How do we cook for it? What is a diabetic diet? How do we cook for that? What is congestive heart failure? What is dementia? What is the difference between dementia and Alzheimer's? My caregivers, because of my background and experience, we train them so they know exactly the type of cases they're gonna go into the home and see and what to do with those type of cases. Plus, I'm on call 24 seven. So if they have somebody that all of a sudden isn't doing so well or they fell, they call me and I say, okay, leave them there. Let's assess the situation. Let's see what's going on. Do we need to dial 911 or can we just get them up, call their family, let them know that they fell, everything seems to be okay. If we have to transport them to the hospital, then that's what we'll do and I'll call the family and say, hey, we're transferring your loved one to the hospital and this is what happened. So it's a little, we're a lot more hands-on. We mm -hmm. are a little more medically based because of my background. I'm not a franchise. So I can run the company any way I want to. In other words, I can give you the individual care that you need, not what some franchise tells me that I have to do mm -hmm. for a client. Like all the franchises I know is a four hour minimum. We don't do that. We can, if we have a case that they don't need that type of care, then we don't have to do that type of care. We try to do what the client needs, not what somebody else is dictating us to sell to a client. All right, and you have uh, obviously a great flexibility of different plans. Absolutely, we have anything from what we call a tuck-in service where we just go at night, make sure that they took their night meds and get them dinner and put them to bed. Or we have a rise and shine, we do the same thing, just go in for two hours in the morning, fix mm -hmm. them breakfast and make sure they're up and showered and ready to go for the day. Or we can do the 24 seven care. We just do anything that that client needs. Very good. And I want to give uh, your local number here. It's 949-489-8770. And uh, you can call that number and uh, to, to talk uh, to someone to have them come out and assess your needs and then create a plan that's right for you, right? A care plan, yes, we do. Individualized care plans that's right for your specific needs. All right, Julie, thank you very much for coming on. Thank you again. We appreciate it. We'll be back in just a moment. We're going to take you out to Valley View. at home important to you? My choice in home and senior care can make that possible. We give you the assurance that you or your loved one is being cared for in the comfort of their own home by a certified caregiver. We offer flexible services that are customized to your needs. Call us today for your free, no obligation, in-home assessment. Be sure to ask about VA benefits. My choice in home and senior care. We specialize in you.